You're welcome back. Sadly, we couldn't bring Ife Omai for this segment, but trust Osarage and my humble self to make sure we give you all the updates regarding entertainment. And right now, the gist is that the teenage comedian uh, has been nominated, and that's, that's talking about Emanuela Samuel, has been nominated alongside Ikorodu Boys, Elsa Majimbo, Ghetto Kids. Emanuela Samuel has been nominated for the 2021 Nickelodeon Kids Choice Award. Her nomination, which is the second, has the child star contend for the favorite African social star category alongside Nigerian skit makers, Ikurudu Boys, Kenyan comedian Elsa Majimbo, South Africa's Bonang Mateba, Uganda's Ghetto Kids, and South African magician Vian Denverberg. Emanuela was first nominated for the renowned Kiddies Awards in 2018, and that's alongside African superstar Davido. They both lost, sadly, to Ugandan singer Eddie Kendo. Sergey, so. this is really big for kids and basically for entertainment because it's the Nickelodeon, you know, Kids' Choice Awards for 2021. Mm -hmm. And I know you've been definitely following, uh, what's the name now, Ikuru Du Bois, and how they basically mimic music videos, movie trailers, and all of that. I don't know what you think about their consistency over the years and how they've been able to, you know, get so popular that movie makers worldwide send them kids gear and now this nomination. I'm, I'm, so what, what the Ikuru Du Bois story really shows, shows is um, how a lot can be gotten with so little. Um, they've been able to achieve the success and the popularity and the stardom. They've been recognized by movie studios across the world, by movie actors, some of the biggest names across the world. Um, with just the very little that they have, they've been able to, you know, use the wheelbarrows and, things, and yes. you know, cartons and cardboard sheets and little plastic, you know, guns and and what whatever they could. Um, to make themselves become international superstars. Um, and that's for me is the, the excitement of the Karuda Boy story. Um, a lot of people maybe waited until they got, they got you know, big equipment or maybe well, until to invest you know, in, in big equipment, but they didn't. And they've been able to make themselves one of the biggest names in the, in the, you know, in the world today because True. of what they did. Um, and so I'm happy for them. Same thing with Emanuela. Um, she's been on this for a very, very long time, even if, you know, she started when she was really, really young. I don't know how she will transform, you know, when she gets into her late teenage years and even older, you know, but I'm also happy, you know, about her story and how far she's gone. Elsa Majimbo also, this, this happened in, in the COVID year, yeah. 2020. Um, and she has been able to gain recognition from every, well, not every, but numerous major brands across the world, including Rihanna and the Fenty brand just by making very, very short skits, you know, and short videos. Without on, makeup. On, without makeup. Just, just with chips just, and exactly. very funny lines. And fake glasses. Yeah, um, exactly. And so it's, it's, it's interesting for all of them, but Ikorudu Boys, I'm, I'm particularly excited for them. And I feel it's inspiration for um, kids across Nigeria today, that even if, yes, you may not get all the equipment that you need, you may not get, you know, mm -hmm. you know great studio to make your short movies, they can still create, you can still be, you know, be productive, you can still put in just a little work and it will be recognized across the world. I hope sure. they win it. I hope one person I hope out they of win Nigerian it. I think you have to vote for this. Um, Kurdu Boy um, sent out a tweet that said, good news, we've just been nominated for the Nickelodeon Kids' Choice Award. Please vote for us on Twitter and they put all the hashtags there if you want to vote for them. Oh, you can, you can check them out on social media. Now, this Nickelodeon Kids' Choice Award is an annual American Child's Award uh, ceremony produced by Nickelodeon. It, you know, it's on as the biggest television, the biggest movie, the biggest music act you know, voted by viewers worldwide of Nickelodeon Networks. I feel they should also separate the categories. I'm, I'm not sure why Davido has been nominated with Emanuela and also Majin. Yeah, for and, last and, year, uh, right? I'm sure, I'm sure no there, there are um, categories for that. Yeah, they, they, pro they, they maybe should uh, separate the categories and you know, let's have Ikorudu Boys, Emanuela, just little young entertainers, you know, take those places. Eddie Kenzo shouldn't be winning a category that Emanuela is nominated right. for. Right. Makes, well, <laughs> you know, makes no sense. So really? So they should, you know, do that so that we're sure that when next they're making nominations for the young kid and children entertainers, we definitely would have Nigerians 
who have been extremely creative and hardworking win those awards. And we yes. should also create our own awards here in Nigeria um, that, you know, would celebrate these people. Yes, but we should. Happy for them, so. you know, regardless. Yes. So congratulations to every Nigerian child that have been nominated, even those, you know, out of the you know, Nigerian, out of Nigeria. So congrats, Emmanuel, like Kurdu Boys and the rest. And yes, here's where we draw the curtain on the breakfast uh, for yes, today on Plus TV Africa. I trust you've had, you know, listened to very inciting, uh, in, insightful conversations and have learned a thing or two, you know, you're able to shape your thoughts about national issues, you know, from the protest that's about to hold, yeah. we'll find out if that would eventually hold or not, to so the, um, you know, COVID-19 pandemic treatment and response in Africa, and as well as, you know, how the Senate would now debate on long-lasting solutions to the farmers and headers clashes in Nigeria. So thank you very much for staying tuned once again. My name is Annette Felix. And, and uh, we'd always say if you missed out on any of these conversations um, or you, you know, joined us late, get on social media at um, Plus TV Africa, Facebook, Twitter and Instagram. Same with our YouTube channel and uh, catch up on any of these things that you may have missed. We want to wish you a beautiful Tuesday ahead. It is goodbye from me. See yes. you tomorrow. Yes. Bye-bye. Cheers. <laughs>